Welcome back to Innovation RC, guys. Today, we're gonna be doing something I've been wanting to do for the past month, about. Pretty much, if you guys remember, I pulled myself on the little dolly. Well, we're gonna see if we can pull my car. I did see a video of a Summit that was pushing a car, but I don't think that's exactly legit. Why? Because the Summit was actually wedged in between the rear bumper, and it was forced to actually push it. Obviously, the gear reduction was able to overcome the car's inertia, and that's good and all, but I wanted to be in front. I wanted to legitimately pull what my car is. We're gonna see, and we're gonna have proof all around that this truck is legitimately pulling my car. So if that seems interesting, let's get right into it. All right, so let's have a look at Brutus real quick, guys. If you see, I have the GPS up on there so we can actually verify how far it pulled it. And if it goes too far, what I'm gonna do is just, you know, stop it because if it pulls it, it could probably do it till the battery runs out. So as you guys can see, I actually cut little uh, uh, air intakes. So that is the only thing I did to the body. We're running two 4S batteries in parallel though if you see that oh you might say it's still in a series connection but it's a series parallel therefore from the batteries it's still only giving 4s power i don't want to run 8s because i don't really want to disturb diffs um so that's going to limit me and actually help me out a little bit um and we do have a capacitor but the only thing that that's going to do is just give power flow efficiency you know pretty much the esc already comes with one but you know, it's not really gonna be much of a big difference that you guys are gonna see when it pulls that. Uh, we have the stock motor, stock ESC, uh, stock gearing, everything is stock, tires are stock. Um, pretty much, it's stock, guys. So let's see what we can do. All right, guys, now what I said the only thing I'm going to be adding, legitimately adding, is weight. This is a seven and a half pound uh, dumbbell weight, uh, pretty much, I'm just going to be putting it like that, just in the front, just so we could really have all four tires on the ground as it pulls uh, my car. All right guys, so here we go. Car is in neutral. No one in the front, no one in the back. Instead of GPS zeroed out, it's more like car zeroed out. No one over here, no one under. You could all see. No one around me. Just me and Brutus. All right, guys, let's see what it's got. Here we go. He's doing it. Hell yeah, guys. He is doing it single-handedly. Okay, now let's do it again just to confirm. Car's at a complete stop. But I think I want it to drive a little bit quicker. Okay, what I'm gonna do, I need more weight. Let's try this. All right, this is about like 10 pounds or so. It's a little hydraulic jack I keep in my car. We're all zeroed out. Let's put it on this way. Oh yeah, look at the rear squat now. All right guys, here we go. Run number three. That is a lot better, look at that. That center diff is screaming right now until we get up to speed. Here we go. <laughs> we did it, guys. Brutus is single-handedly pulling a car. Again, there's no one in this. No one in it. No one at all. This is crazy. Go, Brutus. That is my boy, <laughs> and I'm standing on here now. This is crazy. All right, now to confirm it, we're gonna have to do it again. So we're all zeroed out. Oh, nothing on the uh, GPS, because we haven't gone far enough. All right, here we go. Let's do this once again. 
Look at that. He's doing it. Come over to this side. Whoop. That was awesome. Okay guys, just me and Brutus. We're about 300 feet from here to the car. We have our uh, little GPS zeroed out on the trip. So what I'm gonna do on here, you're gonna see a little GPS right in this corner. That's what I'm gonna edit into the video. So we're gonna get our speed that way and we're gonna compare it to here. So we're all zeroed out. All right, let's see what we can do. With it pulling me. And seriously guys, do not try this because it is kind of sketchy. Ugh. All right, here we go. Woo! <laughs> Here we go. That is crazy. <laughs> it pulled us three tenths of a mile which was all the way over there and back and back again i could have gone more but my butt started to hurt uh, <laughs> that's crazy let's see what top speed we got 15 miles an hour wow it actually got really sketchy at that point that is crazy i hope you enjoyed i certainly did my butt did not uh, so if you really want to see more of this stupid nonsense, make sure to subscribe below. Also guys, make sure to check out Innovation RC on Instagram. I actually upload pictures, videos, whatever, you name it, of everything I do here before it hits YouTube, as well as other insights of what I might do for future videos. It's pretty cool, so if you guys want to check it out, definitely do so. Stay tuned for future videos. We have a lot of stuff coming out and this just scratches the surface of what I'll be doing. I just wanted to see if I could do this and it's possible. Till next time guys.